Hi everyone, it's Ryan Ritchie with another iPhone app review, and today we're taking a look at decibel. Decibel, well, a decibel is a measurement of sound, right? So when we go into decibel, you'll see this nice looking analog meter, and what it's showing you right now is a reading of the decibel level in this room as I'm speaking and recording this particular review. And you get an average, a peak, and a max. Now the difference between the peak and the max, basically the max is the peak over time, if you will. The peak is the current max. But at any rate, uh, I can click here on the max to reset this to start again, and I'll be silent for a moment. You'll see that my room has an ambient sound of about 45 decibels. It's pretty neat, but one of the uses I thought about for this would be to go to a concert or, you know, go to some place that's loud that you want to know, hey, just how loud is it there? And unfortunately, and this isn't really the application's fault, but the iPhone microphone uh, clips basically at peaks at about 100 to 105 decibels of sound. So unfortunately, beyond a loud yell, you're not going to be able to actually get a reading. However, I gotta tell you, on my next video shoot for clients, I might whip this out and start walking around with it. It certainly looks important and looks like it does something uh, worthwhile. And it does, like I said, up until that 100, 105 decibel threshold. But for 99 cents, it's a great looking analog meter on your iPhone to measure basically everyday decibel levels. For the digitallifestyle.tv, I'm Ryan Richie.